desperately needing a goal to lift the spirits of the crowd as much as anything else. Either Lee or Sooners could hit it. Lee does so. Dalglish. This is Kennedy in space. Rush, and then Robinson. And Robinson finally gets off the mark for the first time in a senior match for Liverpool. Robinson again. Rush back for Robinson. Could be a good goal, this. Number five for Liverpool. Johnston. Getting past Rowe, who tried to hold him back, and Robinson, 2-1. And while Robinson takes his share of the congratulations, a number of the Liverpool players went to Craig Johnston as well, because he sped past Terry Rowe here. The driven cross, always a problem for defenders. Robinson collected and scored. Well, the wind has really carried that an enormous distance. Bond's in trouble, there's Robinson, and Liverpool take the lead. Michael Robinson. Robinson clearly injured too. And he had to be brave. That enormous kick by Grobelar, fooling Bonds completely, and the header found the net. Good layoff. And better ball still by Dalglish to Johnston. Robinson continues his run in the middle. Sunas and Robinson, that's his second. And Liverpool take a 2 0 lead. Well, once again, Liverpool's stylish play down the left hand side, important in the goal. It was a fine cross by Johnston. Bonds. A poor clearance, really. Sooners had the first effort, and Robinson finished off. Sooners for Liverpool. Robinson has worked tirelessly for Liverpool's cause, particularly since Johnston was sent off, and they were reduced to ten men. He really has had an excellent game. Here's Lee. Sooners. Now Gleish wanting it. And Robinson, and that's the hat-trick! And the man of the match, deservedly, gets number three for Liverpool. A good build-up, Lee and Dalglish involved, but Robinson's finishing was immaculate. Well, here's Dalglish. Sunis. And again, Sunis. This time for Dalglish. He's got Rush waiting in the middle. Up the post, and it's in there by Robinson. Started by Neil, Sunis now for Dalglish, played in there, hammered against the post, and then put away by Robinson. Playing in his first Merseyside derby, gives Liverpool a 2-0 lead. Michael, a lot of people, I think, courtesy of ITV, watching their first Merseyside derby. What was it like for you to play in one for the first time? Well, it was fantastic. The atmosphere was marvellous. There was a great reception as the two teams came out, you know. Um, it was, it was marvellous. It's just a great spectacle, I think, and uh, to take part, and it was a privilege. It's smashing. Were the Liverpool players surprised at Everton's tactics with virtually five in midfield in the first half? I don't think we pay much attention to size tactics. I think we try and get it right ourselves pass the ball to another and let them worry about us. I don't think we were concerned for a moment about Everton's tactics or how they might play. Um, we were just, as I say, concentrating on ourselves and trying to get it right as Liverpool. We were joking before the game about whether you might get a goal or not, and to your great moment, Julie arrived. Tell us about it. I can't remember it, really. Uh, Phil Neal plays the ball in, and I'm just a bit tired of the back post. Kenny managed to get the ball across, and uh, I stuck it in to the post. I was in the wrong position, I think, really, but... Anyway, it's gone in, and I'm delighted with it. How are you feeling settling in at Anfield? Um, well, every game's a big game. It's something that's uh, very new to me. Every game seems, well, this is the one, lads, we've got to win this one, and then the next week it's the same again and the same again. 
Um, I don't know what day it is. I just come to, come to train and, you know, hope I get selected and, and just play the game. It's uh, it's all up in the air. Every game's a very big game for us, and I'm enjoying it. But as for settling in, I think it's presumptuous for me to say whether I'm settling in or not. That's for other people to judge, I think. But certainly I'm enjoying it. Michael, thanks very much indeed. And Nickel with the flick. Rushes in there. Robinson! Liverpool take the lead, and Michael Robinson is the scorer. Back after injury in Kenny Dalglish's shirt, the flick on by Nickel, the jump by Rush, Robinson's right foot, 1-0 to Liverpool. Liverpool don't score many goals from corners, but tonight they're bending them into the near post in the fashionable style, and as that one dropped, Robinson made no mistake. Sheffield Wednesday enjoying so much possession at the moment. Pearson's flick. Hansen away. Mistake by Madden. Robinson rushes up with him. Robinson! What a superb goal by Michael Robinson. And just as Sheffield Wednesday threatened to break back, Liverpool may have clinched it. It was a mistake by Madden. Set Robinson clear. He looked to his right to rush, but finished superbly instead. Michael Robinson's 11th goal of the season. He's already beaten his total for the whole of last season when he was with Brighton. He'll be delighted with that. Kennedy. Robinson. Oh, that'll come. Off Fennick to Sammy Lee. Rush trying to get it on for Robinson. 2-0. Well, it was a Rangers error in the first place. And Lee capitalised on it by Terry Fennick, I think. And there was Fennick number six trying to get after Robinson. But the man had his sights on the goal. And there was no chance for Hucker. Really good work by Lee, pouncing on that error by Queen's Park Rangers. And finished off superbly by the man who now notches up his 12th goal of the season, Michael Robinson.